Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today's lunch will be mini minced meat fillets in fried tomato sauce. So let's begin. Right, so I've got my pan here and I'm going to turn the heat on to number eight out of nine and I'm going to add some sunflower oil there enough to fry the the fillets in also I'm going to be having them with Galician style boiled potatoes I'll leave a link in the description so let's wait for this to heat up and here are the minced meat fillets which I made yesterday I'll also leave a link in the description. Basically they're 50% beef, 50% pork, a few spices and they've been covered with um, breadcrumbs. Okay, so once the oil is nice and hot I'm going to fry these in two batches. And after about three minutes, I'll turn them over. So after another three minutes, these are done on both sides. So I'll take them out. And put them on this plate with a, a paper towel to get the excess oil out. And I'll add these back in and do them the same way. Right, so these are done as well. Obviously the insides still or still run raw, but they will cook later on. So I've got my nine mini steaks here. So what I'm gonna do now, this oil it's it's quite useless basically. Because when you fry breadcrumbs, it just kills the oil. But I will not throw it away. I will put it in a jar and use it to make candles. So I'll be back. Okay, so I've got my pan cleaned again. So this time I'm going to add about three tablespoons or four of olive oil. And I'm going to add, it's a small onion and three garlic cloves. Obviously you can use more or less. The choice is yours. And I'm just going to brown it off. Okay, so once the onion is slightly browned, what I'll do is um, I'm going to add the carton of tomato. And of course, you know what I'm going to do now, don't you? It's amazing how much tomato is still left around the edges. You could feel it in the weight. So I'm going to fill that, I'm going to add a bit of water and give it a few shakes. And chuck it back in. There you go. And I will also add some salt, obviously to my own liking, because I'm the one that's going to be eating it. And I'll mix it about a bit. And I'll just wait there. I'll cover it up and wait for it to start bubbling. About two minutes. So, once it starts to bubble, what I'll do is put the fillets 
over the on the tomato. There should fit exactly this pan because it's a big one. I think it's a 30 centimeter pan. And I'm going to cover it. I'll turn it down to number three. So that's on medium low, I think it's called. And I'll put these potatoes to boil also. So 15 minutes. Well, 15 minutes have gone by. So what I will do is turn these over. This tomato sauce is smelling incredible. Okay, so they're all turned over. Mm, I'm going to try this. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Yay. So what I'll do is cover it up and leave it for another 15 minutes. Okay, so time's up. Well, let's see what we have here. Look at that. So I'm just going to do a check. I, I don't need to, but just to show you. Look at that, nicely cooked inside, beautiful. So, I'll turn the heat off, and as usual, I'll serve it on here. Right, so let's put these here, and see what they look like. And let's chuck in the sauce. Oh yes. Well, so here is the result. I hope that you enjoyed today's recipe video. If you did, give me a like. Leave me a comment and nothing else. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Cheers.